In this video, we are going to talk about oogenesis, that is formation of ovum or female gamete. This is a pregnant woman. In her womb, a fetus, which is a female fetus. Oogenesis starts in the ovary of the fetus when it is in the womb of the mother. Now, zooming into the female reproductive system of the fetus. In the ovaries of female fetus, the germinal epithelial cells inside the ovary wall of the fetus starts dividing by mitotic cell division and forms oogonium cells. These oogonium cells goes through growth phase and forms the primary oocyte inside the ovary of the female fetus. Now, when the primary oocyte goes through meiosis 1, it gets arrested in prophase 1 of meiotic cell division 1. And this stops here until the female fetus borns and becomes a mature woman and comes to the puberty. When it reaches the puberty, inside the ovary of the female, the cell which got arrested in prophase 1, the primary oocyte, starts dividing again and completes the meiosis 1 and forms secondary oocyte and one that is first polar body. Now, the secondary oocyte goes through meiotic 2 cell division. In this process, it gets arrested again in metaphase 2 of meiotic cell division 2. It remains arrested until it reaches ovulation and fertilization. After fertilization, the meiosis 2 cell division completes. That is, formation of ootid or ovum occurs from secondary oocyte. And after the formation of ovum, the male pronuclei and female ovum meets and fertilization complete. In the other hand, the first polar body produces two more polar bodies and secondary oocyte also produces another secondary polar body. That is, total three polar bodies are produced. From germinal epithelial cell to oogonium formation is called multiplication phase. From oogonium to primary oocyte growth phase. And from primary oocyte to ovum formation is maturation process.